How you doing? I'm Guy Fieri, and you've got tattoos. Hey, where'd you get those tattoos? Then there's this tattoo, which is the culinary gangster. Then there's the platinum grenade. I don't know why. This, I cooked at the White House. Just being patriotic, got to have the bird from the bill. That's all right here, right now, on Diners, Drive-Ins, and Dives. Wonderful? Yeah! <laughs> oh my god, that's hot! Super duper weenie. Super duper weenie. You're the big weenie here. Mm. Where's that been all my life? Sweet to heat. Mmm. A big flavor. Gosh, that's good. What are we doing? This is what it's like this when well, the big weenie we starts to have a meltdown. Represent, brother. Hello, I'm Evan Tomac aka Guy Fieri's Disciple, and what you just witnessed was a brief montage of some of my favorite Guy Fieri moments, and it revealed his wild persona and intriguing behavior. But behind those heavenly frosty tips and that thick tan bod scathed in beautiful tattoos hides a completely different humble story filled with both ups and downs along the way. Come with me on a journey and I'll show you the world behind those mysterious backwards flame glasses. Guy Fieri, born Guy Ramsey Ferry on January 22, 1968, grew up in Ferndale in rural California. Throughout his childhood, Guy was always spicing things up with entrepreneurial ideals, including a balloon stand which he would cleverly run outside of a county fair, starting in fifth grade. He added a pretzel stand to his business, and he gained enough money to spend a year in France at the age of 16, where he would develop a keen interest in French cuisine. Fieri had his aha moment when eating delicious steak frites in France, which cemented his love for food. Guy graduated from UNLV in 1990, and got a job at a California Italian restaurant called Louis Trattatoria. In 1995, Guy married his spicy spouse Lori and decided to change his name back to his immigrant great-grandfather's original surname, Fieri. Guy stumbled upon numerous culinary jobs trying to perfect his craft and eventually landed a spot on the next Food Network star. After winning the competition in gangster fashion, Guy Fieri was awarded his own cooking show, Guy's Big Bite, which is still on air today. He would later star in numerous cooking specials, including his magnum opus Diners, Drive-Ins, and Dives. So from then on, Guy Fieri lived on happily ever after without any scandals or controversies whatsoever, right? Wrong. Guy Fieri has been pinned for numerous crazy claims, including anti-Semitism, hatred for gay people, and being extremely racist. There's something about that. Oh. That is gangster. That's racist! Oh. Well. Fieri's posse once broke an elevator when they were drunk. He injured one of his neighbor's racehorses when he was drunk. He fired up a race car by his next door neighbor and did donuts in the street and even got in a fight with his hairdresser. Even though he has been the center of numerous scandal claims, his close friends and agents assure everyone that he is not a racist, anti-Semitic, and he loves gay people, and all people for that matter. He has even officiated over 100 gay weddings. More important is that culturally, Guy Fieri is probably the most important and the most polarizing figure in the food scene. He is one of the most powerful people in the food business. Like it or not, tons of people watch his show, advertisers flock to him. He is, like Paula Deen, a huge, huge star. Whether Guy Fieri is chefing up wild flavor combos or acting wild in his souped up race car, 
He is the center of all gangster lifestyles and attracts everyone from all places. Well, there you have it, folks. My boy Guy's entire life story. It's Evan Tomac signing off, America. And as always, have a special Fieri fun day, my dudes. If Pyro's and Crips all got along, they probably got me down by the end of the song. Seem like the whole city go against me. Every time I'm in the street, I hear caca. Men down, where you from? Gangster, fudge. You know where you from, my Gangster. Where your grandma stay, huh, my? Gangster. This Flavortown. Yeah, I run, my Gangster.